Hi, it's Mitch from PickDogs.com here with the free pick in the Reds versus Cardinals Major League Baseball matchup on Sunday, September 10th, 2023. Here on YouTube, I do tons of free pick videos, so be sure to subscribe to our channel. We do free picks every day, sportschatplace.com, pickdogs.com, right here on YouTube, as well as across social media and our live shows. And when you give out that many free picks, you're bound to like some games more than others. And to find out which games those are, as well as to get best bets from the world's best handicappers, head on over to our website, pickdogs.com, click on the premium picks tab. While you're there, use the discount code PICK. You'll get 15% off all of your purchases of $19 or more. We also have the Pick Dogs Dime Club. And the way the Dime Club works, well, it's geared towards larger, better. So it's not for everyone. But if you think it might be for you, call or text the number that you see. You'll talk to a live person. They'll answer all your questions. But let's get to this one. We've got the Reds taking on the Cardinals. And, you know, the Reds kind of teetering around in this wild card race. Are they in? Are they out? I tell you, they've been slipping a little bit recently while some of the other teams in front of them have been playing well. But, uh, you know, the thing about this Cincinnati Reds team, these guys are tough as nails. And I lived in Cincinnati for a while, you know, almost 10 years. And uh, I got to say, while they love their Cincinnati Bengals, they love their college basketball, they really love their Cincinnati Reds. So I expect to see the Reds, you know, get that fan support as they come down the stretch here. And, you know, they're you would hope that that would help them. But what we've seen from this Reds team is they have a losing record at home. And that really is the differential as to why they're on the outside of this wild card race looking in. I can't really explain it. They're the only team in either wild card race that has a losing record at home. And like I said, you know, I lived in Cincinnati, so I know they love their Cincinnati Reds. I mean, I grew up with the grit with the big red machine. I didn't even live in Cincinnati and everybody loved that team. So I think, you know, I think what we've seen from the Reds this year is maybe maybe they are just short, a couple players short, or just in against teams that are better or ahead of them at this point in in the in the uh, whole grand scheme of things. You know, the Reds last year had one of the worst records in all of baseball. They started the season like 0 and 25 or something, and were done before they even got started. And then this year, you know, to almost make the playoffs or to be at least in the discussion is uh, you know pretty big turnaround. Meanwhile, the St. Louis Cardinals are a team that haven't missed haven't had a losing record since 2007. And they absolutely stink this year, but they are, uh, you know, they're, they're too far back. I mean, after, if in four more losses, they'll lock in that losing season. So, you know, they they got to be thinking for next year. And at the trade deadline, when they didn't trade away their superstar players, they were thinking next year. But actually, they've been playing pretty decently down the stretch. Miles Michaelis gets the ball today for the for the Cardinals. Not one of my favorites. Hunter Green for the Cincinnati Reds. You know, his health issues and then his performance since he's come back from the injured list have been part of the problem. I think we're going to see a lot of runs in the second-best hitters ballpark in all of baseball. Great American. I'm going to take the over in the Reds-Cardinals, and that's going to be my free pick. Of course, while you're doing your picks today, putting your bets in, be sure to use our free betting tools at sportschatplace.com. Our betting tools are 100% free in the way they work. They show you just how often all the bets on the board today actually hit. Then they show you today's odds, and from there, you can assess the risk reward, putting yourself on the bets that come in the most and pay the most. That's how you make money betting on sports.